In this video, we would like to show you a cost-effective and practical approach for collision avoidance of industrial robot arms. In most of the modern factories, human workers often share the workspace with robot arms. As a result, keeping workers safe from the robot arms is essential. In our approach, we propose an invisible sensitive skin that can cover the surface of the robot arms and it is capable of detecting obstacles nearby without contact. Here shows the contactless capacitive sensor modules, in which the resonant frequency of a LC resonator can change if there is any conductive material around. The capacitive sensor can detect a large area by collecting an antenna. The sensors can be installed inside the robot's arm such that it will not be damaged by exterior environment easily. Five capacitive sensors have been used to cover the major surface of our robot arm testing platform. These figures illustrate the corresponding sensing regions. It is around 5 to 10 centimeters above the robot arm surface. In the first experiment, the robot arm repeats the predefined motions in default. A person opposes the robot arms in different directions. It can be seen that when the person gets close to the robot arm, it will stop immediately. It is because the person is detected by the embedded invisible sensitive skins and the system terminates the motion of the robot arm to prevent collision. In the second experiment, the setting is similar to experiment 1, except the robot arm will resume work when the obstacle is removed. The system works well on detecting human body in different directions of approach. Although this video does not show, it works well even the human body is covered by clothes. It also works well on detecting other conductive objects such as spanner. This method eliminates the use of massive sensing units and zero sensing death zone can be achieved. As a result, this approach is very cost effective and practical. The major limitation of this system is that it does not work well on detecting non-conductive objects. However, it is promising to protect humans from getting hurt by robot arms. We thank you for watching the presentation.